Rocking with PettyBlog.com. It's your boy, Snoop D O W G, and you are now watching the Petty Blog. I can't be on the Petty Blog. <laughs> petty and T. Oh, Petty. So they already know that I'm dropping the T. So let's get right into it. As y'all may know by now, Usher Raymond got married to his longtime girlfriend right after the Super Bowl. So congratulations to them. But here's something rather odd. Also, after the Super Bowl, he had an interview with People Magazine. And would you guess who the newlywed was reminiscing about? Chili. Oh, wow. Like, huh? How'd that work? I'm confusion. But anyway, let's cut to the chase and let's read the People's article together verbatim as I'm reading it for the first time. It's titled, Usher reveals that he proposed to TLC's Chili and their split broke my heart. Really did love that girl. Exclusive. Once a match made in R&B and hip-hop heaven... Usher and Rosanda Chili Thomas just weren't meant to be. Usher 45 digs deep into his ex-files in this week's People's Cover Story, opening up about his past and deep love he once shared with fellow music star Chili, whom he dated from 2001 through 2004. To kick off his dream of becoming a star, Usher moved from Chattanooga, did I say that right? Chattanooga, Tennessee to Atlanta, where he released his debut LP at 15 and his first hit album, My Way, at 18. Wait a minute, y'all. I thought that he was originally from ATL. Didn't he say he put ATL on? But I digress. The seductive persona he portrayed on that album wasn't just a marketing creation. I was always charming the older ladies. And for the record, Chili is only seven years older than Usher. And she looks damn good for her age, baby. But yeah, so it was when he met Chili, who was seven years his senior in 2001, if I am to be honest, I was her number one fan. And she was my superstar. Not into the lyrics of Superstar on Confessions, his blockbuster 2004 album that was on heavy rotation amid the aftermath of their highly publicized relationship. At the age of eight, I put her poster on my wall and said, man, that girl is so beautiful. One day I'm going to meet her. But their fan beloved relationship didn't work out. And he and Chili, now 52, split in late 2004. I was a young man and she had very specific rules that didn't work for me, he says. We were missing each other. I really did want to have a different type of relationship where she was there with me and she couldn't be. She didn't believe that I was actually in love with her as much as I was. Interesting. Even so, he says, I wanted to marry her. I proposed and she told me no. Ooh. I went through a great deal of pain after that. Not trusting women or wanting to open up, he admits. I hurt her too. But the situation broke my heart. Aww. Chili previously told people of their relationship. It looked great, but in real life, he knew he had to be a certain way with me and he couldn't. Still, she said their relationship remained off and on for years following their split and would pick up when they weren't in other relationships. Oh, wow. That's interesting, y'all. Now, that is some tea. Usher, however, says that for him, things ended at the time of their breakup. Huh? Anyways, we were cool with each other, but I was very careful with that, he says. I really did love that girl. And I was like, I don't want to play with you. Like, I can't give you what I gave you. I did everything that I thought you would have wanted me to do. But I guess my good wasn't great enough. What, now, what did I say? It's the way you say stuff. What did I say? Both are now happily coupled up. Chili is dating actor Matthew Lawrence, while Usher just tied a knot this past weekend in a surprise wedding to his longtime girlfriend, Jen... Huh? Hold on, y'all. <laughs> y'all know I can't read. Jen Go Shoshia. I'm sorry if I butchered her name. Oh, well. No disrespect. Just after his show-stopping Super Bowl halftime performance in Las Vegas. These days, I'm not hurt over that at all. Sure, he says, of him and Chili not working out. We've since become cool with each other, celebrate each other, and it's always light when we see each other. And meanwhile, while he's huffing and puffing about them not working out, Chili was on the resort with her new bae. Ooh. But you know what I think? I think that Usher should let it burn at this time because it seems like he got it bad. It's giving you married one knowing that it should have been the other. <laughs> no, but I'm just saying. But maybe he's been bottling that up for a minute. I mean, apparently. So at least he got to get it out. But what are y'all thinking? We really want to know, so leave your thoughts below. Like and share this video, subscribe to this channel, and if you haven't done so yet, be sure to become a channel member. Pettyblog.com, signing out.